Is pesticide necrotic? <laughs> poison? <laughs> it, it, poison? It's, it's like yeah, acid poison. damage, but specifically for them. You yeah. Know? Uh, I'll say it's poison damage, but the Shambos are immune to poison, the condition, and the damage, except against this. I think that makes sense, right? right. I, like, kick them, kick them where they least expect it. You know what, yeah. Crash? I think this this is the advent of chemical damage. I think it's necessary. Chemical <laughs> <laughs> damage, that's honestly. Ass. That's sort of ass, um, if you think about it. Um, I don't know if that you saw Crash, a... but I did put the... Yeah, I saw it. Okay. A little chart. Yeah. Uh, it, that was just, a, like, a little atomizer spritzer thing that they had, right? Essentially. It does shoot in a cone. Right. A fitting for a cone. Uh, I would say like it, it doesn't take an attack roll, so that might be something you guys are interested in. Yeah, it, it does it like, uh, can we apply it to a weapon kind of thing? Or... No. No. Uh, it could what does it take to use again? It's a living pod. It's, you supplement one of your attacks with it. It has uh, I only have five one, uses. But... It has hmm. five uses per pod. That might... I think to make guns Jin would... no for me. J Jim would take one if he could. At the very least, like in case we want to use it for like an environmental thing, like if there's like a fucking wall of mushrooms that we need to get past or something, it might actually do something against those. Potentially. Yeah. So how would I mark that down as just? It's a perfumer bottle. Pesticide pod. Pes Pee -pee. That's a good name. <laughs> uh, pod. And so Let it be known. He does. Plus... Once it grows on you, it doesn't come off until it dies. This, is, this yeah. is fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, Grover no. is a band of interesting capabilities, and there's some drawbacks to it. It's halfway to a parasite, except that you, you get it to kill itself. So that's, sort of, that's pretty cool. The um, bombs that I got, I forgot to ask, what kind of damage do they do? Uh, if this there is are any, they'd be fire, right? Yeah, fire. Okay. There we go. It was so I have six fire bombs. <clears throat> Start spraying everywhere. Auto damage, auto damage, auto damage. Spritz, spritz, get damage, get damage, get damage. No. I mean, it is a seed pot. Anyways. No! <laughs> <laughs> I hate it here. <laughs> You're welcome to hate it here. I hate it. Anything else? Um. I'm pretty occupado. Yeah, I can't pretty... think of anything. Fair enough. I mean, you yeah, guys got some some supplies. You got some, some good goodies. Just a couple. Then, Just then let's take a spine. let's take a five minute break. And Perfect. Last I can time get I my, my third arms. cup of coffee. I need to wash oh, my arm because it's bleeding. You are a crack addict. <laughs> I'm almost done my jug of coffee that I got yesterday. No, the day oh, before. Oh my god. A full it's day has passed, coffee. and it does. I don't remember. And I thought Denver was bad. For what? <laughs> Addictions. For the, for the, the collecting. I don't know. It's a crap. I don't have a problem. I can stop whenever I want. <laughs> stop collecting voices in your head! Kirsty. I want! Is that, a way to, is that any way to talk about a town you've never visited? What? What? Denver. Oh, <laughs> fuck me! <laughs> <laughs> that took me a hot minute. My uncle's from there as well. I should have <laughs> I can stop whenever I want. I just don't want to stop. Oh, you're going to I don't have a problem. company in your head. <laughs> screw this. It's like the hmm? drinking problem uh, meme. I drink all day. I didn't know, screw this. No problem. Mm -hmm. Oh. I am actually debating going to get coffee. I, can't, I want to, but I don't want to. Mm -hmm. I mean... I don't know how I was, was going to follow that sentence up with, but yeah. I mean... <laughs> I mean <laughs> silence. Yeah. Ow. Just life. Do you feel the universe around you? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh, no. oh god, there's things around me! Oh god, damn it! It's the universe, get it off! It reminds me of the Mother Mother song. In Infinitesimal, I think it's called. Very, very See, tiny. Nothing ever touches, it all sort of floats. Arrow. Huh? I hate that one, actually. Is that, is that a new album or something? 
No, it's one of their old stuff. Mother, mother. Oh, yeah, mother, mother, yeah. Yeah. What, what is this, Nina? What is this? What is this? A band. What? 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 Music. This this thing yeah. you're talking about. It's it's a ba It's a Canadian band called Mother, <sighs> Mother. Uh huh. Uh, and they have a. Uh, hold on. Uh, cookies. Yeah, they got some good chins. I'll give them that. I don't want any of their cookies. <laughs> let me let me look it up. There's a million, billion, trillion stars, but I'm down here though. Infinites, in infinitesimal, my mother, mother. My mother, mother. <laughs> Copy and paste. <laughs> so so evilly. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't touch, it just sort of floats. That's when you think it comes to blows. Just know it won't. Because it can't, bro. I need to look up the lyrics. When is that? Oh, I have heard this. Yeah! Yeah, I have heard this one. I just didn't recognize the name. <laughs> <laughs> the lyric that I like that I think is really funny- I like this whole song, but one part that I think about often is- And did you know that when you- when you get- when you really get close, nothing really touches bro, it just kind of floats? So when you think it might just come to blows, just so you know, it won't, because it can't, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that was a sentence. <laughs> So that just, so just like next time you, next time you think you're gonna get into a fight, just think about it. All right, nothing actually touches each other, so you can't actually, can't okay. actually touch it because it's not touching. It doesn't do that. The atoms don't touch. Oh, we're talking about the truth of matter. I see. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What? Huh? Matter well, if is you think space. about it, like if you, next time you go into a fight, the atoms they ain't gonna touch. So like you're not actually hitting each other. You're not you don't want to go down this line of logic because that's this because this is some Jujutsu Kaisen shit, and it's and that <laughs> that that manga sucks. So. <laughs> Jesus. I'll be right back. Oh, actually, Crash, I have a question for you. I posted in the Fred private channel. Is this more like uh, accurate to the armor style at the moment? Uh, it's more accurate, yeah. Listen, it's literally just a Dark Souls three like lo like Fallen Knights. <laughs> it's exactly what they all are. Oh, I see. I I, I never I haven't played it, but I think I, I think seen some pictures with the like the shroud over it and everything. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's the that's a full thing. I guess is it the concept art? Yeah, I think this is a concept art, maybe. Why does this one have a... Is that a fucking gun? Hmm? If it's based it? off 1500s, they did use guns. Ah, that one looks like he has a shotgun. Like a... <laughs> looks like he's ready to go play Doom. Oh. Oh, yeah. That or it's like a really weird looking crossbow. Which would be a bit more fitting for Dark Souls, but also looks Dark like... Souls meets Bloodborne looking ass. Actually, you know what that looks like? It looks like the um, multi barrel it's pistols. Blood. Oh, maybe. Oh, yeah. The rotation. Those uh, duckboat ones? So, so yeah. it is Dark Souls meets Bloodborne because they have those in Bloodborne. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, snap it. That's a ghost. Oh. The spook. Of me. I will say, we're probably going to end pretty fast today. Oh. Yeah, because... I, I was talking to Nina about this. I don't think mm -hmm. it's surprising to hear that you guys are going to get into combat in the Warzone City. What? I know, what? right? The thing is, I don't what? want to run a combat when you're about to hop off and Alec isn't here, so we're basically be down two people. Oh, okay, yeah. So, so we're probably not going all the way to four today. Oh. But it's fine. It's fine. Sorry. Here's what it is. I'm Alec. I do. Alec, if you're listening to VOD, love you, bud. Love you, Alec. I'm back with my third cup of coffee. Yeah, <laughs> How are you not, out? like, I do not have <laughs> cheeks. <laughs> That's a really uh, good question, but I don't, so... 
Maybe because I ate a whole pizza too. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's all I'm eating one today. Cup of coffee. I'm like I'm like a blooming I don't know, junkie or something. Like Weak. Usually I am too. Weak. I know anyway. I am. I mean you all know I, I, I can't take coffee. <laughs> like it's one of the few things. I mean, I'm not oh, making any more crash. I, I, this is my third, and it's even bigger than the last two. And yes, I think we are. No one's muted. I think so. I think all we right. are. Mm. All right. Yeah, oh. So, we're all back. Let's get back into it. Nova would have returned back very fast. It would not have taken her hours to come back. It probably would have taken her like 20, <laughs> 20 fucking minutes. <laughs> um, she doesn't talk to you guys, though. She excuses herself. You guys don't know for what, though. Um, before you guys do set out, Grover does uh, send a runner to go collect all of you. You guys regroup all together now. Potions distributed out, etc., etc. And Grover mm -hmm. has a dead body of uh, one of the uh, dispersers. Uh, this one hasn't didn't explode, so that's that's cool. Denver's uh, keenly interested. Uh, where is it? There they are. There it is. Disperser. Rah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. We're all here. All right. I think that's everyone. Hope you guys had a fun. Do you think about to say it? Fun time around the camp. You I just wanted to, to touch. Sure. Very good. Very good. There's a bomb going off. All right. Get <gasps> <down>! <laughs> <laughs> now for your first test, <laughs> this <Disarm> is bomb. <laughs> Audrey, be like <laughs> for your first test, survive. <laughs> Anyways, uh, microwave aside, uh, Grover does walk over to the disperser, which is a large sized creature. Grover is a small sized creature, so it's extra funny. Um, <laughs> we was walking over it. I just wanted to touch base with all of you before you went to the city. I recall what you guys described in your uh, recounting. He looks over at Anvil, right? He nods, right? And it seems, after talking with some of the guards and examining some of the samples we have nearby, he throws a thumb over at the dead ship. My bad. My bad, I haven't indicated that he's dead yet. There you go. The dead sham, or not, dead disperser. Oh, thank God he's dead. I was worried. I, I came to a... arrived at a conclusion for a theory I had. Uh, he looks over at Hawk, who's strangely quiet, don't worry about it. And regarding Miss Sirena and things of the sort, it does seem like, perhaps unsurprisingly, that this fungal plague wh parasite, if that's how you want to address it, uh, does have very hyper-evolutive capabilities. They do evolve very fast. And I wanted to touch base with you guys, as I said. You might want to keep your eyes out. Or, in your own mind, determine threat analysis, assessments, things of the sort. You guys are well familiar with her common shambler. He gestures at the burning pyre over there. Mm -hmm. Numerous, not particularly dangerous, aside from the fact that they can swarm and crowd and hold you down for other threats, such as he gestures at the disperser, and this guy here. And this one here is pretty built in to uh, explode. A uh, uh, fungal suicide bomber. Fun notion. Bit ineffective, though, if I have to confess. But it... After talking with some of the guards, there are some others that you guys didn't recount in your tales and uh, I thought you guys should be made informed of in case the guards haven't done so already. I guess you would call them advanced life forms for them. For these shamblers. I had heard that there were some bigger ones, some nastier ones that are good at sieging through things, so definitely keep an eye out for those. And from your guys' tale, there's the ones that shouted and shrieked. Keep your eyes out for those as well. But there might be some others, newer ones. I would say target them first. Unless you determine that they're not that dangerous compared to the other forms. But when you guys get the chance, regale me on them. I would like more... Sample size for my test. Am I understood? Gives him a nod. Look for new life forms. Mentally record down what they do. And tell me about them. If oh. we can manage to get a sample. If. That would be... That would be nice, but... 
your account is 10 coil as necessary. Should I roll cheekiness for Nova? No, I don't think I will. So uh, we'll who would be who would be closest to Nova? Let's reuse the bottom order on rule twenty. <laughs> Badger, congratulations! <laughs> oh my god, I see. She leans over and she's taller than you. Everyone else is, uh, but she leans over and whispers down to you. He likes you guys. Yeah. All right. All right. You talking to me? Yeah, who else am I talking to? <laughs> He's just like staring at a, a better shock. Out. I like you. I like you too, bud. <laughs> she doesn't know uh -huh. what she's unlocked. No. <laughs> Wait till she gets the Christmas list. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Gotta go out for more gifts. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, she like begins finicking around of her her mask, her helmet. This, because we keep in mind every time Nova talks, it is like a robotic voice. Let me know if you can't understand me through this. I can take it off. Actually, she looks up at the sky, all the plague spores and everything looming around. Now I'll be fine. No, I die. We've been exposed to it, and we look at us. <laughs> What was that? I I think I'm having trouble hearing you. Just take off the helmet. <laughs> Animate his fuck face. Unlocked. <laughs> uh, there we go. Uh, ma marry me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bewildered. Look at that. What? How many fishes do you have? What? <laughs> <laughs> I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. I will do the same. She winks at you. <laughs> Badger just has this giant grin on his face now. <laughs> Eva, you guys can hear Eva whispering over to Fias. And he finds another one. <laughs> <laughs> he, he nods. He does. Mm -hmm. Is it... Never mind. <laughs> He's a lucky man. I think he finds his luck wherever he can find it. Yeah, he shrugs. Tomato, tomato. Mm, tomatoes. So, oh, you guys have your debrief from Grover. You guys have seen Nova unhelmeted. Um, uh, I w oh, actually, actually, I got something for you guys. He can actually show you some of the life forms that the guards reported. So you guys, you guys know the disperser. He's, yeah, he's, yeah, he's be pretty. He disperses. No, I yeah, disperse. He disperses. <laughs> uh, you guys know the boys. My favorite token because it's literally the boys <laughs> meme. <laughs> Me and the boys when we're gonna go spread the plague. Uh, <laughs> you guys know the Shambler Swarm. You guys would have been told about the. Oh gosh, which one is it? The Shriekers. This is one Mina has fought in once. And after nearly killed a bunch of people. Yeah, that's the Shrieker. Oh, what a pretty guy. And then the last one you guys kind of would have heard about <coughs> would be the Ruiner. Size category, big. Ooh. Christ almighty. Ooh. Shit on a stick. The guards in a port. Don't get hit by it. Yeah, don't get hit by plan on it. No. Is it what's called the Ruiner? The Ruiner. She kind of looks like a Ruiner. She's gonna it looks like her. the size of a building. <laughs> yeah. It is the size of a building. It's size category huge. Damn. No, thank you. Oh, I hate that. Damn, that bitch oh. huge. Oh, wait. No, not, wait, no. Actually, actually, it gets better. He, he counts as a living siege weapon. Bruh. Yeah, so fuck your building. Fuck your walls. Fuck the ground. protection. Don't fuck the ground! <laughs> they're, 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 I'll put they're, my dick in the earth! They're, 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 they're plants. So they, they have to fuck the ground. No! I, 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 I die. Are... So these are some of the targets that you guys might run into. <laughs> and some other ones that haven't been seen yet. Tee? I, I have a quick question. It's, it's not really yeah. related to it 
yeah the the situation at hand i suppose but do do these do these fellas have to start from like some sort of living animal organism something like the plants uh yes they do require a a a host we'll call it so is there just a teeny tiny little man inside that siege weapon how the hell I mean, does he get that oh it, it's probably more overgrown. than one body well, hey, hey, I'm happy you brought that up. I'm really happy you brought Plant that up. Plant Mika. So, so the ruler has is, he actually has a plus four proficiency bonus, but he only gets to use half of it because there's too many, many people many inside it. People. There's too many people inside it for it to use its full oh, proficiency bonus. I was scared you were going to say that. It's, yeah, so it does. It, it, it's, it's a big boy. Big boy made many... Boy. Many boys. Boys. Big, boy. big boys. So he's big men. Instead big, of gender fluid, it's gender fungal. Ah, so <laughs> oh, his voice is sweet, consistent. <laughs> yeah, I heard the very soft fungal fluid. <laughs> Should have taught you that word. <laughs> oh. Yep. So, so that, so there's your, there's your answer that Grover can give you guys. That the ruiner is actually, it has enough biomass for what constitutes probably like a dozen people. Bro. Yeah, almost just looking very disturbed in the background, just like, oh no. <laughs> Grover does not life choices. <laughs> Grover does not pick up on that, or if he does, he he pointedly ignores it and continues on with his clinical description of every single uh, <laughs> specimen that he has uh, archived. Yeah, yeah. Uh, is very interested. <laughs> this is a nightmare. Mm -hmm. uh, while, while he's describing these nightmares, uh, uh, could, could yeah. Jin uh, request that he also shares the the centipede knowledge? It's coming from them, it'd probably sure. be more understandable than if Jin tried to re-describe it. Sure. Uh, I will give one other thing. Um, me, when he's talking about the Shrieker, Mina just sort of mutters under her breath. They're not that tough. They're just fast. But they crumple. Like a tired against the rocks. So, that's just something Mina mutters to herself. You bring up the like, centipede uh, information, or at least bring it up for a Grover to address. Right. He wags the finger at Jen. Uh, after some visual examination on Irina there, I wanted to point out to you guys, and please do not be alarmed. It, Irina is, I'm sure you guys are unsurprised by this, a non-threat in terms of your security. Aside from normal fungal over, over control, but he uh, wags his head. That's neither here nor there. Uh, Miss Irina is a, uh, I'll call it a victim or a host for a, a centipede, a very specific type of undeathly centipede. She like scans and looks over at Hawk, who has Irina next to her, and she just seems. It's like when you guys told her about her uh, anatomy when you guys were in Valtonio. She doesn't seem perturbed, but she does seem a bit confused. Uh, you guys might be familiar with the term. Some of you might be familiar with the term spontaneous generation. Uh, that is what occurs in so every now and again, very rarely, uh, some dead bodies, uh, overgrown with mushrooms or not, from the looks of it. Uh, what normally happens is the centipede uh, takes control of the host body, but uh, in this case for Miss Irina there, it does look like it's bit its way out, as evidenced by uh, the the rips in her torso and head. Uh, at the mention of spontaneous generation, uh, Denver's ears do perk up. She doesn't say anything. <laughs> That's me, I know that. I know that one. <laughs> I don't know if that's an anomaly to what you guys know of Irina or her uh, upbringing, past, her past. But I thought it'd be something to note in case it's relevant to any of your findings going forward, especially as you go against the uh, colony king. He does air quotes as he says that. But something to keep in mind. Uh, with that, I have nothing else to present, so you guys are dismissed to go back to your productive uh, afternoon. More like we're ready, she puts her helmet back on, to go into the city. And off we go. 
I think this is when Dahlia would uh, dish out the potions. Potions dished. Distributed. <laughs> uh, I'll just ask the group. Do, do any of you want one of those scrolls? He doesn't. I don't think Jin needs three of them. It would be pretty funny if he dodged three attacks. It'd be kind of fun. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, but also I would rather diversify. Diversify. Diversify, diversify the portfolio. Your <laughs> Um, I'm good because <laughs> I haven't been using all of Dahlia's, uh, like, defensive shit. Like, I right. I have a thing that lets me not die once. Plus, I have advantage on death saves, so I feel like I don't want to go down, but, like, someone Man. else could use one of those. I think uh, the, the squishiest of, of us should should take those. Yeah, Karadok, you own one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I I am not squishy. I'm just punching bag. <laughs> he can take a lot of hits. Downside is he is very easy to hit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so well, not right that... now. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's true. Wrapped in metal. <clears throat> uh, what was it the scroll did exactly again, Sony? I've it's completely uh, left me. Automatic damage reduction. Nope. Uh, no, okay. we do, we definitely do not have it. Right? Ba basically, it's uh. I don't even think it takes reaction. On one yep. instance of damage, you're instead swapped out for a log. You oh, move yes. 30 feet away oh, without provoking it. opportunity. You literally just miss a step, and you don't take the damage. And you have to activate reaction? the scroll. Nope, it doesn't take a reaction, but you have to activate it ahead of time. You can't yeah. get hit and be like, I use a scroll. You I use a scroll yeah. up to an hour ago. Then you use then you activate the ability, but you can't pop the scroll when you're getting hit. It has to be popped earlier. And you can choose on it which instance of point? damage it activates. Correct. I don't think it takes an action. I, I think it's just... Like, to uh, activate I it, I mean. I remember. To, to, like use the scroll, to use oh, the scroll, it too. takes an action. To yeah. to teleport once the scroll's state is active on you, it doesn't take anything. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Pretty fucking good scroll. It does, yeah. I mean, to be honest, I've got stuff that kind of covers that anyway, so... Yeah. Like, I'm, I'm good. Thank like, you, know. So, so what I'm hearing is, Jin wants to help us, everyone. Everyone's like, now nah, we're good. It's like, damn, I guess I'll just take the really good scrolls. Nobody loses in this case. I don't need your help. <laughs> but I mean, you can always save them for another instance, too. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. So, you need to go bust them think all for this instant. Uh, Eva Besides, who knows, we might change our mind later. We might be like, oh god, please help. <laughs> Eva and Fires would take it if you're offering to the group, but if you're only offering to PCs, then I think the PCs have made their verdict. Uh, do they need it? Fires crumples once he gets hit, yeah. Yeah. I, I think that's a good use of it. Sure, at the very <laughs> least, they're holding on to it. Alright, do that, so I'm working on the shoots then. Why, and you get ask from back. Well, maybe not. They do. They're probably gonna pop them before or as you guys get into the city, because less an hour. Yeah, yeah, less an hour. My chemical trance last again, because I might pop one when they pop their thing. It's like ten minutes. No, doesn't. Oh, Nina, is, is the little uh, table of contents that you posted there? Is that the basic healing potions that you distributed? Yes. And I put yeah. the rolls the there too. Yeah, I, see, um, I, I don't want to. One hour. There you go. So, yeah, if I can pop it at the same time they pop those, I'll, sure. uh, I'll chug a pot. Oh, and then I overheal. You guys get 14 temp HP from Captain Herman. Ooh. Ooh. Hey. That gives me 50% so. more health or so. That's really fucking uh, good. I will say, you guys can, if you're so interested, roll into it. Oh, okay. Fine. I will in a minute. I need to add it to the NPC sheets. I'm rolling really well tonight. That's really you, you, for yeah, you, you, you actually are. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah. 21, 20, 14, I'm kind of scared six. of it next week. You're scared of <laughs> <laughs> That's how much I, I overheal. Ah, uh, I see. <laughs> that's what uh, you roll for. Officially over Captain Herman's health. <laughs> um. Roma and Jin, um, <laughs> you guys all benefit from the strategic mind probably more than the six friendly creatures, which could include yourself. 
I don't know why I kept the wording there. Anyways, so you have to all benefit from strategic mind. Captain Hermit is not. He's giving it hmm. to us. Aww. To a degree. Yeah, that's part of it. Mm -hmm. He's literally giving me like half my HP, like exactly half as well. Based. Which is pretty cool. Oh, you have 20 HP? <laughs> He's giving an impressive amount 20, of Yeah, I've only got 20 HP. HP. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, well, I guess you have to uh, make sense, actually. Yeah. Thank God she's good at dojo. To quote yeah. Gimli, I'm sitting pretty comfortably on 43. I don't, I don't think Gimli, Gimli says said exactly that. that. One. He says exactly that. At 43, he says that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, I, why don't I believe you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm pretty sure it was Would 43. Would Fred lie to you? Yeah. Oh, wait, no, you're talking about, wait, wait, is it his kill count? Okay, now I believe it's it. It's his kill count. Oh, yeah. okay. oh, okay, okay. I'm gonna look it up. Right before Legolas says it was twitching. Hmm? God, wait, you're right. Damn, that's a really good memory. <laughs> good, good fucking memory. I'm remembering that. <laughs> so, you guys good to go? Final call. Uh, yeah, I last think so. One. My, I just need to check one more thing. Last gear checks, conversations, in the safe zone. I'm over healed, but not breaking my books. Okay. Karadok lifts up the visor, forgets to secure it, it falls down, he lifts it up again, <laughs> secures it. Yeah, that, it probably does catch you guys off guard that Karadok went from being a dressed nobleman to a geared uh, guardsman. Yeah, yeah. Th there's probably a moment of like, oh, excuse us, sir, then we look back, it's like, wait a second. Hey! I was just getting over her, uh, her trauma from learning what the big tall thing was and now it's talking like suit of armor like ah yes okay <laughs> this makes sense <laughs> big we are big. looking into hell big. back the fuck up back the fuck up big. hey big mama let me no, back up. your ear no, <laughs> no stay away from my ear go away stop approaching the chat no he wants to roll a d20 for sanity big. i don't big. know big. Big. get away oh big. wait no he's an amalgamation big. of things he's crazy he, oh, do you think he does sanity damage? It, whatever. Oh, oh, I hope not. Like Thanks. it's using half of it because it's crazy. Good. Oh, it might fucking mess with your sanity. That'd be interesting. That would be neat. I do cool want to. Do. I want Wait for him to just pop around this like little edge. <laughs> uh, Mind fuck me. <laughs> I, I, I will say no. Like, grow, like I can tell you guys that for free because grow. Mm. Things that do sanity damage, it's either events or creatures that are like. Outrage in their mm. magic or natural capability. So that's don't get me wrong. The ruiner is horrific, but it's, it's not horrific. But, but it doesn't have the ability to tap into your mind and scream into your soul, right? It's not that eldritch, right? It's not. Yeah. It's not, it's not, it's not, yeah. He's just. They didn't have mouths. He, he doesn't have a mouth. But he must scream. He must. <laughs> <laughs> and you know who does the screaming for him? This guy, the shrieker. The, the, the one with the, the, that thing. You guys are gonna love oh, or hate the shrieker. Name? I feel like love... we're gonna hate it. Oh, I'm definitely gonna hate it. Like, well, I, I can tell you, I, I could. I will quick one thing for you, which is, I guess. Then I've decided I mechanic. love it. <laughs> uh, I'll hit you guys. I'll hit the one button. Their core mechanic again, because Mina fought one of them and won. Well, her and a bunch of guardsmen fought it and won. Screams medicine this warning. Trying to locate victims. All oh. enemies within 30 feet must. Yeah. Okay, so that's bad for me. <laughs> a little bit. The thing is, the effect goes away until the st at the start of its next turn. So that's to sort of constantly sh scream. <gasps> what does it take in action, or does it say? This is a bonus. What's that's a bonus? Wait, what's this say? DC 15. That's not a horrible wisdom thing. Downside, I only have a plus two. Was my hey, you're almost right. made it. <laughs> almost. Ah! Oh, just don't think. Not the five. It's not the five. <laughs> just don't fail by five or more. Yeah, easy. If you succeed by five or more, you 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 become less of a target to it. I I don't. Is there a single one of us that is good at wisdom? Oh wait, no, the fucking Dahlia. I wonder. I wonder who it could be. Okay, mm -hmm. sorry that I tried to. Yeah. You, know. <laughs> you, you could also roll high. <laughs> just roll high, though. Yeah, but it, it's a it's a fight you want to avoid if it's like you have to roll high or you are doing real bad real fast. Yeah, yeah. So this is the shrieker. 
the voice. There's gonna be most of our time in the city. The voice, the person that's still the shrieker, tries to warn people. Oh. Yeah, he doesn't always succeed. Hey, y'all should get away. <laughs> yeah, I told you. That, um, if you guys have ever played Dead Space, the guys that have the explosive fist, they that's the reason they sh they scream. I got the giant fist. Oh, really? It's, it's like a it's like a pustule more than a fist. Yeah, that's why they yeah. scream. That's canon. Huh. Yeah, so you think like, oh, the oh, game makes it so easy. The exploding guys yeah. scream at you and they notify you when the exploding guys are at. No, there's a canon reason why they scream when they approach you. Because so they're that, trying to warn and you. And it's just sad. That <laughs> trying to warn you and save your life. So, it insinuates yeah. that the necromorphs are still semi-sentient human beings yeah. in there. Yep. Oh, God, the babies. Yep. Be right back. Oh, moving on. I don't <laughs> want to know what that refers to. Um... Oh, don't you worry about it. Space, have you? Don't worry uh -uh. about it. You should. Dude. It's, it's a fun game. Super fun game. I can. Um... Yeah, you, you like horror games, right? You like. You like. No. Yeah. I oh, can no, sort you... of deal with YouTube videos of somebody else describing horror. I. <laughs> yeah, you should play a horror game. That'll be fun. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. So, you guys are uh, t -t 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 taking off. Delete. Uh, Thanos snap. There we go. Oh. They're gone now. No, they're dead. They're dead. That's right. The last. That's the last we'll see them. No. Actually, yes. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> it takes away the Ash Warrens, but it gets rid of one Ruiner. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. So, you guys, uh, you guys ready to get going? Uh, you guys are taking with you. I don't know why I deleted his token now I think about it, but, uh... Oh, well. You guys are taking with you one, Captain... Get that fucking face out of here. Get this <laughs> fucking face out of here. Get this fucking face out of here. What sort of, what sort of insane old man would he be to go into this with a fucking open visor helmet? No helmet at this rate, I wouldn't be surprised. Get the fucking face out of here. Um, don't worry, this is going... Like, I just want to die. Don't worry, uh, he does have some other people coming with him in the form of Honor Guard. If I can find where the sheet is. There, there. Um, just to give you guys an idea of Captain Herman, because he will be joining you as invites. Three, four. Nice. You need to take four. Ah, uh, four. How many do I have? Uh, two, two. He's taking two. <laughs> He's taking two Honor Guards. <laughs> they don't have that many of us. Um, <laughs> they have some, but just not as much as when they started. Um, Captain Herman uh, can issue some stuff out for you guys. Um, some of his orders don't work for you guys. These ones don't work on you guys because you guys aren't guardsmen. Um, but he does have a couple that do help you guys. He can spend his bonus action to get you guys to move, and he could. Oh, I didn't give. I didn't put the quote in on that one. Shit. Oh well. We do it later. Uh, or the one that's probably more important to you guys is none left behind. Because that might literally save your life. So, so, just know that he's not a, a force to be reckoned with damage-wise on the field, but he can get you guys into more better positions during the fight. Any fights. I say the odds. There's only going to be one left in the entire campaign. <laughs> well, that'd be oh, crazy. Really? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? We're, we're done! Uh, now no, it's a Chris, no! Done. The passive <laughs> no. from here on. Oh god, why would you do that to us? Oh, he's not gonna kill I... us without Alec being here, probably, maybe. Uh -huh. What? Like kill he Alec wants to kill his already. homie. Like, no, I hate like, <laughs> 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 all the trauma when his character comes back and they're all dead. Uh, you guys will be rendezvousing with Captain Keenan. Here he is. Uh -huh. Remember how I was saying, what's our crazy old man would walk into this place without a helmet? He what? would. Yep. That kind. Oh, yeah, what a freak. Yeah, yeah. He's a motherfucker. The one that has the alert feet that can't be surprised. Mm. Paranoia is the greatest helmet of all. <laughs> Actually, I don't know why I'm showing you guys this, all these tokens now. Like, right, like on this slide. Why don't I show you guys on this slide? Oh my god. Oh. This is a you guys. No, this is a crevasse. Cre it is, it is a crevasse. Uh, th 